G'day guys, Steve Turner here from the tech services team at Papercut. I'm here today to talk to you about Papercut MF and how it can fit within your organisation, no matter how big or small you happen to be. So let's start with a simple scenario. You're a relatively small company that's running a print server. That print server is where all your users are doing their printing from. So with Papercut MF, you could actually install the application server on top of this print server. Immediately after installing it, we start capturing those print jobs that your users are sending to this print server. Not only are we capturing that information, but it is immediately available for you to start reporting on. You can actually restrict users in what they can and can't do. Now, if you wanted to take it a little bit further, and you wanted to be able to see everything they're doing on, on those devices, we have an embedded client. The embedded client can actually be installed on top of your MFD. Now, when it's installed on the MFD, what it does is it enables you to track not only printing, but photocopying, scanning, and faxing. So what if you're slightly larger? We've got multiple print servers in, in this scenario then. So we've got our Papercut secondary print server. This can then be installed on top of those additional print servers that you're running to enable you to capture the print jobs that are printed to those servers. That information is loaded back to the application server. Now when it comes back to the application server, that gives you a central location for all that reporting. Not only reporting, but because we're managing everything from that application server, you can manage your whole print queues from a single instance, from a single location, and that is through that application server. So let's start talking if we're getting bigger still. So we're now a medium to large size business. Now in a medium to large size business, we may have a lot of MFDs and a lot of users that we're using to be able to do this printing. Now in that scenario, you may find that you're running external databases. The good news is, Papercut can work with external databases just as well as it can with its internal database. So as you can see, we're starting to expand into these larger environments and we can suit each of these different scenarios. Now I know what you're thinking, we're only talking one site. So what happens if we start getting larger still and we've now got multiple sites that we're printing from? Well, the good news is, you can use a secondary print server at those sites if they're just printing. If we're using the embedded that we were talking about earlier, we have another installation type that can be done, and that's called a site server. Now, the site server installation will actually provide resiliency in your network. What does that mean? What it means is if the link goes down between that remote site that you've got and your primary site, what happens then is the site server will allow you to continue printing at that site. People can still log on at the devices, they can retrieve their print jobs, and you've got happy campers. Fantastic. Now, what if we're talking really small sites now? If we've got a site where we've got, say, four or five users in it, it's not worth putting a print server in there. But we still want to be able to capture the printing that they're doing to that local printer. So how do we do that, you ask? We've got this another installation type, surprise, surprise, called Direct Print Monitor. Direct Print Monitor will allow you to install this client locally onto the user's machine. Now, when the user prints this time, it will capture those local print jobs and it will tell our application server that they've actually conducted this printing. Again, it reports back to the application server. We still have that central location for all our reporting needs. Fantastic, I hear you say, but what about cloud? I've been starting to move everything into the cloud environment, what do I do about that? Well, with the cloud installation, Papercut treats a company's private cloud in exactly the same way as we would another site. So what you could do is you could install your application server into your private cloud, and it would work in exactly the same way as if you'd installed it at your primary site. Quite a lot of information in quite a short piece of time. This is a really brief overview, and it can get even more in depth than this. But we have ways to meet any different scenario that you have. Thank you for your time. Appreciate you listening. Bye.